Okay guys, um, today I'm going to be picking this lock here, which is a, a little old Union brass padlock. Um, nothing too exciting, it's only a, a little four pin padlock made in England. But I thought it was a nice little thing, so um, I'm going to get it picked on camera. It's working with the key. Just show you the bit in there on the key. Um, it's stamped there on the bottom. NAT188 and on the key which is nice it shows it's the original key okay and there we go it's picked Doesn't seem to be any spring at all on the um, the shackle. I'm not sure if there's meant to be, but there's no no spring in the shackle at all. I don't know if it's worn away or what. Maybe there's not meant to be a spring in there. The um, the plug is spring loaded. It does open both ways. Um, you can open it that way. And it also opens that way as well. You can see there the sort of colour the lock should be, the brass colour, so it's very dirty. I'll probably give it a clean up, maybe put some pictures at the end of the video. It has got a bypass on it. I'll try and uh, find it for you now. Okay, I think I've got it on it there. There we go. Show you that again. Normally, you'll find um, in most cheap locks they'll only have the one locking bolt there on the shackle, um, nothing on this side. They normally always have a bypass in there if you can find it. But there we go, that's the, uh, I think it's about a 35mm old union brass padlock SPP'd and uh, maybe at the end of the video I'll add some uh, pictures of it all nice and cleaned up. Okay, well thanks for watching, uh, keep watching because we'll be posting some more videos soon. Please leave your comments and uh, please rate the video. Cheers.